welcome to the Alta Sierra Country Club. I am going to give you a full tour via this golf cart. I'm gonna stop along the way and take video for you and show you around. I'm gonna take you back to the center of the country club, which has the bocce ball and the restaurant and the driving range. I just got a full tour from the new general manager, Phil. He's amazing. He's been here about five months and prior to that, they really didn't have a general manager. And so he owned his own driving range for about 30 years. And so he's got tons of experience that he's bringing to the table here. He's making all kinds of improvements, which I'll tell you about um, when we get back over there. But I'm gonna drive the golf course and make lots of stops and show you everything. So let's hit the road. If this is your first time to the channel and you wanna know everything about living in Nevada County, California and the surrounding areas like Grass Valley and Alta Sierra, subscribe. And my name is Cheyenne and whether you're moving in three weeks or three months, my partner and I would love to help you. All of our contact info is below in the description. These are some of the golf course homes behind me. It is just so beautiful here. I love the rolling topography. I love all the trees. There's all different kinds of trees and it just, it feels good here. It has a really good feel to it. And what a beautiful place to live, whether you're on the golf course or um, around Alta Sierra and, uh, in the areas that we saw earlier. This is just, I really, really like this neighborhood. I don't play golf, but I sure do want a golf cart now. Look at these views. It's just absolutely so beautiful. I've spent quite a bit of time in Alta Sierra showing homes, but I hadn't had the full tour of this golf course and I'm just so impressed with how beautiful it is. There are many ponds throughout the golf course and I just saw a beautiful bird. I think it was an egret, so beautiful. There's another huge pond right across the way here and there are others also. I just wanted to make another stop and show you more beautiful views. Huge pond over here. I don't know if you can see, but there's two birds just hanging out there in the middle of the pond. And then here's on this side, there's some golf course homes here. And yeah, let's keep on going. We are coming up full circle here to where the restaurant and um, swimming pool and pickleball and all the amenities are, the driving range, so we're going to go check all that out now. I am up here at the driving range and when I first got here today there was just a couple gentlemen playing or practicing and I don't play golf, can you tell? And now there's a large group of young ladies, maybe teenagers who look like they have some teachers with them and learning the sport of golf. So I think that's pretty cool. I love to see teenagers and young people doing something other than looking at their phone. So I'm really loving that this is happening here. So Phil has a lot of plans for the Alta Sierra Country Club. And one of them is that this whole area here is going to be have solar panels so that it's going to create a shaded area and they're going to put a little cement pad and patio furniture and it's going to be a place where you can have shade and sit down and enjoy yourself in between um, maybe practicing on the range here. So the solar panels are going to go pretty close right up to where you hit the golf ball there so that you can hit the golf ball and then just step back a few feet and sit down in a nice shaded area. There will also be lighting installed to the driving range so you can golf after the sun goes down and they are creating what's called a top golf atmosphere for the driving range with food, music, drinks, and seating areas minus electronics and if you're a golfer you will know what that means so you can get married at the Alta Sierra Country Club if you would like and this is the space that you would rent out for a wedding it's completely encircled by these trees and the pool is just on the other side there and they do close the pool down for a couple hours during the ceremony just so that you don't have the noise of the people playing at the pool but even with a little bit of pool noise, it's very serene in here and it feels like you're just enclosed in this really magical little setting that I'm sure once it's decorated for a wedding, it just looks amazing. I'm just walking down to where the pickleball courts are, but if you have any questions about Alta Sierra and the country club or just the general neighborhood or some homes in the neighborhood, definitely reach out and give me a call. All my contact info is down below in the description. 
And if you're getting any value from this, consider uh, hitting that like button. And I appreciate you watching. And here is the pickleball courts. This used to be tennis apparently, but I guess no one plays tennis anymore. I don't know. I know people still do play tennis over at Lake Wildwood, but for some reason here, they're just into pickleball. So this is now just a pickleball court and um, they just did some work over here. There was quite a bit of trees that needed to be trimmed. So yeah, Phil is getting a lot done around here and just really making things nicer. And he's just got such a passion for this place. So it's really run by some really good people. Another benefit of this neighborhood is there's a fire station right there behind me. I am standing, so the driving range is right there on this side across the little walkway from the fire station. And then that is the clubhouse where the restaurant and some lounge areas are. So you got the fire station really close, which is great. I just met a really sweet woman who lives right up the way on the golf course. And she was telling me that there is a gym right across the street here. So I've got the fire station right there and the country club right across the street. And then right across the street there is a gym that you can join. It's not part of the Alta Sierra Country Club. It's its own entity, but you can join the gym if you like to work out. So it's nice that that's close by as well. I was going to have a meal at the country club today to do a food review, but the restaurant was closed. But Phil said that he is trying to change things so that it is open on Mondays, but I will come back tomorrow and have lunch here and tell you all about it. The Golf Pro Shop provides equipment, apparel, and accessories for golfers. I did go back to the Alta Sierra Country Club for lunch and I had the fish tacos and they were absolutely delicious. You can dine in the dining room or at the bar or near the bar and there is a fireplace for cozy winter meals with friends and you can also dine outside on the patio overlooking the golf course. There is a ladies lounge which looks out onto the driving range and there was a men's lounge but it has since become a family style co-ed game room. I believe Phil also said that they're going to put some solar panels out here in the parking lot as well to create more shade. Also, he said that the, all these plans should happen within the next year, maybe year and a half. But um, yeah, he's got a lot of things that he's doing to just really upgrade the whole surroundings here. Although it's already really beautiful and amazing just as it is. It has been an absolute pleasure showing you around the Alta Sierra Country Club and the neighborhood. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video or in person if you decide to move to Nevada County. I look forward to that.